In my last video, I show you how to create multi-level dependent drop down in Excel. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to create multi-level drop down in Google Sheet. We have the same data sheet as I used in my last video, and I will show you step by step each and everything how to create drop down. First thing, we just need to select all of the cell you want to apply. So control shift down arrow key control backspace key to move to the top cell again go to data data validation add rule drop down from a range select data range click on this box go to drop down table click on a2 drag the mouse remove the seven by using backspace key hit ok this will create basic drop down if we just go to advanced setting i like the arrow format of drop down in this case hit then go to drop down list sheet and now you will see a basic drop down now i'm going to show you how to create dependent drop down based on selected container i have created two blank sheet one is second level sheet and the one is third level sheet first i will apply the formula here on cell a1 hit equal go to drop down list select c2 drag the mouse down remove the seven hit control shift enter it will apply array formula now hit enter and this will took the data from drop down this sheet so if we select another value for example this one it will took this value if i type here formula filter for the range which range you want to filter i want to filter the second column so i will just select b2 drag my mouse down remove the four by using backspace key type comma and for the condition i will click a2 drag my mouse down remove the 4 by using backspace key type equal go to second level sheet click a1 close the bracket hit enter this will extract the data from column b based on column a now of course we need to remove the duplicate so we will just apply filter function so first type space then hit lift arrow key type unique un double click close the bracket for unique hit enter this will remove the duplicate in this case i want to transpose this list as well space lift arrow key type trans double click close the bracket for transpose hit enter and this will create a unique list for each of the content so if i drag this formula down this will create unique list of country based on selected continent now we can convert this formula to array formula as well so we don't need drag and drop every time what we need to do we just need to delete these two formula first and click on b1 if i type here space lift arrow key by row function for the array i will select from a1 to the end of rows i'm just going to remove four to loop to all of the rows in column a for the lambda i will simply type lambda and what is the name in this case my name is x i'm just going to define x you can define any name and for the formula error expression so i'm using the same function instead of a1 i will simply use x close the bracket hit enter and we will get the same result but now we have only formula here actually by row function loop row by row and apply this function on each and every row now if you go to drop down list select another continent for example europe if you go to second level this will get europe and based on europe this will get selected country now i'm going to switch again to drop down list sheet i will select all of the cell control shift down arrow key control backspace key go to data data validation add another rule data from range click select data range click on this box go to second level sheet now this step is a little bit tricky i will select b1 and i will go to the c1 d1 e1 and i will remove the e in this case because i want the full row so i'm just going to remove the e before i hit ok i will simply type equal sign and hit ok now of course i need to go advanced option i like the arrow format so i will just select arrow hit turn key now if i just go to drop down this sheet you can see this only show the country related to asia this only show the country related to north america based on the drop down table and it also only show the country based on selected continent now for the third level i will do the same step so first thing 
everything i will simply go to third level sheet hit equal sign go to drop down list select d2 drag the mouse down remove the end reference for backspace hit ctrl shift enter and now enter again now here i will use the same formula so if i just go to second level sheet copy the whole formula ctrl c go to third level sheet again double click ctrl v to paste and we only need to update b to c and a to b hit enter and this will get all of the city related to those country now what we need to do we simply go to drop down list again click on e3 seal ctrl shift down arrow key ctrl backspace key go to data data validation add rule drop down from a range click select data range click here go to third level click b1 drag the mouse to the right side i think better to remove the d1 if you want the full row so just backspace hit ok go to drop down list sheet and the and of course you want this in arrow format so just click advanced option arrow hit done and this will create a third level drop down i hope you enjoyed this video if you like the video please subscribe my channel for more video and if you have time please share this video as well thank you so much